Hello, I'm Javis Lewis, and in this quick tip, I'm going to show you how to submit your podcast feed to Spotify. That's right. It was only previously possible to include podcasts on Spotify if you were hosting with larger podcast specific or podcast only hosting companies, and not if you're hosting with one of the regular off the shelf kind of, you know, hosting companies that you get like GoDaddy or whatever the names are these days or if you're hosting with me then you could have a podcast feed and you can include it to the Apple directory and to the Google directory and to many other directories but it was not previously possible to include that into your Spotify directory and that is now possible. Let me show you how that works. The one thing we need is a podcast RSS feed and I've got one here already that is not included in Spotify right now. That's Jay's 3D podcast. I'm using WordPress with the PowerPress plugin and I'm also using category podcasting. So if I head over there, then I can see a list of the podcasts that are currently on here. And this is the one, the 3D podcast that I'd like to include. So I get my feed by just right clicking on this and say copy link. I can also validate it, but we're going to go through how to create a podcast in an upcoming video. This is kind of just to get your feed there. And then in your browser, don't go to spotify.com, but go to podcasters.spotify.com. And when you do that, you can see your podcast on Spotify. And you can log in with your Spotify credentials. So you need a regular Spotify account. It doesn't have to be premium. just needs to be a Spotify account. Log in with that. And once you're in, you can see a catalog of your current podcast. So these are the ones that are currently on Spotify, but the one that I've just copied the link to is currently not on Spotify. So in order to get that on there, you see this list here, submit your podcast. Also, just that note uh, on the 27th of October 2018, which is when I'm recording the screencast, this program is still in beta and Spotify will let you know that usually via a notification that there are other features that they're working on, specifically the analysis features. So not everything is implemented yet, but it's certainly a way to get started. And as they add more features, your podcast will get that. So head over, get started. And uh, what they want to know is what's the link to your podcast RSS feed. And that's the one we've just copied. So let's paste that in. That's the feed. Again, we're going to talk about how that is generated and how you create your own. They're quickly checking it. This description and the thumbnail and the title and the category, that all comes from WordPress or more specifically from the PowerPress plugin. Hit next. And then you can tell Spotify a little bit more about the podcast. So select the country in which it is made. So that's United States. Primary language is, I guess, English. Hosting provider. That is uh, one of the podcast hosts here. But you can also just select the last one here. Other, I don't know, which is like your host. So if you're hosting either with me or with GoDaddy or with any of the other larger hosting companies, independent non-podcast hosting companies, select other or I don't know. The primary category, well, this is my 3D podcast, so let's have a look at, could be educational, that's one idea that we could use, and then I can select a couple of subcategories here, so it could be art, I guess, it could be a how-to, and it could be kind of a more educational. I can also add another category, so perhaps we can find another description of that. It could be technology, it could be comedy, Maybe it's business and technology. It's not so much business really, is it? So maybe I'll just leave that out. Just one category for me. And then once I'm done, again, I'm going to click that big green next button. That's just a summary screen of what's happening here. And I can hit submit. And when I'm happy, then it's submitting my podcast to Spotify. Now, that doesn't mean, and then this little rain parade here, very exciting stuff. Now, that doesn't mean the podcast is on Spotify just yet. It takes a couple of days for the system to kind of catch up and include it in the catalog. But as soon as it's in there, you can go and view it. And I'll show you how to do that as well and get the link to your podcast on Spotify. So there's track podcast. If you click that, you can see here it's not actually, well, there we go, it is now in the catalog, but it's not really on Spotify yet. So in order to see what's going on here, I like, I, if you click on any of these things, it lets you uh, see the kind of stats for the various feeds that you've got here. I've only just uploaded them or included them in Spotify. There's not actually that much going on here. But if you want to search for it, the actual 
URL. You have to open the Spotify app. That's probably the easiest thing in which once you're logged in, you can then go and search for the exact title of your podcast. So that's uh, for, for, in my case, here, say Jay's WordPress podcast or the WP Guru podcast. You have to search for this exact title in Spotify. As soon as you start typing the exact title here, then you can see this link right underneath it, the WP Guru podcast. And that is the link to your podcast on Spotify. So click that, then it'll open up in a brand new window in which you can see all the episodes and uh, how you can play them. And you can see this little icon here, the three buttons in a circle that says more. So if you click that, then you can say share. And here you get copy show link and copy Spotify URI. So those are the, the two things that you can use to give out the link to your podcast on Spotify. If I do this show copy link, then uh, I guess if I paste that into the URL bar of my browser, then I get this long thing. And if I now paste that into a new WordPress post, for example, then that's where that'll come up. Let's test if my theory is correct. Let's go to create a new dummy post here on my website. And WordPress is using open embed or oembed for this. So all you need to do is basically paste that link in. And a moment later, WordPress is now gonna turn this into a nice looking playlist here with all your episodes in. So that's the URL you can share with people. That was it. I hope this was helpful. I hope you could include your podcast feed into the Spotify directory. If you want to know how to create one, then stay tuned and watch some of my upcoming videos in which I'm going to explain how that works. I'm about to create a brand new podcast from existing content, and I'm going to share with you how this works step by step using WordPress and the PowerPress plugin. So if you're interested, stay tuned for that. If you find this video helpful, then please share it with friends, family and total strangers. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Channel. I will see you next time. Bye-bye.